you can learn quite a lot about the masks from the artifacts. But it's not until you create an object and find a performer and bring the two together that something starts to come alive, a character emerges. At the moment, I'm using this mask more like a puppet. To realize its full potential, it needs to be worn by a performer with an appropriate costume and physicalization so that body and mask become an integrated whole. And when that happens, you can start to sense the inner life of the character. And worn by a good performer, masks like these do have an inner life. They may not be inward focused, that's something different, but they are not empty shells. And contrary to John Jones's often quoted assertion, their being is not exhausted in their features. <laughs>